Oh, that's rich. Okay, let's see here. What is this? Here we go. Do I look crazy? Hey guys, welcome back. I'm in a very good mood today because I leave for vacation tomorrow for the rest of the week. Today's Monday, so I'm gonna be gone from Tuesday to Sunday and we're gonna be in colder weather. So I have a decent amount of things to pack in my suitcase. They're all gonna be bulky because of the cold weather. So I really need to pack strategically. So I'm gonna bring you guys along for a pack with me. I'm headed to Lake Tahoe. This was originally supposed to be a summer trip. If you guys follow me on Instagram, or watch my videos, you've kind of heard about this, but we actually had the trip booked for August and then we had to cancel it slash postpone it literally two days before we were supposed to leave um, because of the fires up in the area. So it was definitely for the best. Obviously, I'm glad we didn't head up there and have to drive all the way back home because of the fires. That would have been terrible. It would obviously all worked out in our favor and you know we're safe and healthy, so I really can't complain that much. You know, glass half full, it's actually kind of worked out really great because we're so excited to go there for the fall now it's gonna be like more of a fall cozy trip rather than a summer lake boat kind of trip but I mean they're both amazing but we're really excited to be in actual fall weather and have some fall leaves and just be there for the vibe so that's gonna be really really nice so we are extremely excited this is actually my second time filming this video because I did film a pack with me last time when I was supposed to be leaving but you know shit happens and here we are we're gonna film it again and it's gonna be just slightly different but before we get into it I do have to share that today we have a giveaway so if you guys need some skincare this giveaway is for you I have so much good stuff to give you guys um, so there's gonna be a giveaway in this video and also in the next video I'm gonna be vlogging in Lake Tahoe so there's gonna be a giveaway for the vlog so if you guys don't win for this one you have one more chance um, I have just basically two huge packages of skincare that I'm giving away I get so much stuff in PR packages and just in brand gifting and stuff it's not possible for me to use it all and I don't want it to go to waste I have so many good brands and so many amazing products. I have cleansers, moisturizers, retinols, eye creams, masks. I know I would be excited to get something like this. So all you have to do to enter is to comment on this video. Just let me know what you thought of it. Let me know how you liked it. You can just say hi, whatever you want to say. But just so that I know you're entering the giveaway, include your Instagram in your comment. If you don't have an Instagram, you can put your email either or you don't need both. Um, so however you want me to contact you, if you win, just leave that in the comments. And that's kind of your entry. I'll know that you're entering if you have your Instagram at or your email email in your comments. So good luck. This giveaway will run for a week from today and I'll be contacting the winners via Instagram or email. Okay, this entire time I've been talking, I've just like slowly been getting closer to the camera, but let's go ahead and get into the packing. I have reserved my entire day for this packing process. I decided to do all my little like tasks yesterday, like, you know, the things that you need to do before you leave town, that's all taken care of. So I just have a few little things to do around the house today, but for the most part, I've reserved this entire day for packing, for outfit planning. And you guys know that I do Instagram, I do YouTube, I'm gonna be blogging the trip. So planning my outfits is really important to me. It's something I've always enjoyed doing, but especially since I've been on YouTube and sharing alpha photos on Instagram, I want to plan my outfits and wear some cute stuff and just be prepared. So um, for me, it's the most practical and just makes sense. So it's so funny. I'm like thinking about how I've reserved my entire day for planning my outfits and packing. Like this is a prime example of why I don't have kids yet because I would not be able to do this if I had kids. Like I'm like, okay, all day Monday, I'm packing and planning outfits. Like you can't do that when you have kids. So this is like literally why I haven't had kids yet. And I stand by that. Okay, so, ooh, I forgot I already have some stuff in here. Um, let's try this. I am using my Bays luggage. This is the larger one. I'll link which one it is below. I can't remember the name. It's like not the carry-on size, the bigger size. I actually just got it this year. So it's only like my second or third time using it. And I also have the Bays um, packing cubes. This is not sponsored. I was gifted these things like earlier this year, but it's just what I use. So I'm using the Bays packing cubes as well. I actually already packed like the essentials, my pajamas, underwear, bras, socks, that kind of thing. Just the obvious ones to get them out of the way. Um, so this is my pajamas <laughs> packing cube. I have it labeled. And then I have the larger one and a few smaller ones. 
as well as like laundry bags and stuff like that. I think I'm gonna start by just kind of looking through my closet, pulling out pieces I think I'd wanna bring, and then just kind of go from there, pull out my jackets, decide which ones I wanna take, and then start planning outfits from there. And I'm gonna watch last night's Real Housewives of Salt Lake City while I do that. I made a little smoothie for some fuel. Housewives on in the back, life is good. Let's do this. I wanted to show you guys a few things I picked up for the trip. Um, just I went to Zara before me and Bree did a little shopping. We did we did like a whole shopping day for our last trip. We bought all this stuff for the summer trip, and then we just ended up wearing it at home and like during the summer instead of on our trip. So we had to do it again for a part two to prepare for um, this road trip. We went to Zara to get some like fall stuff and just kind of had a little shopping day. Um, so it was fun, but I got some stuff from Zara that I wanted to share because I haven't posted anything yet or shared it in a haul. I have shared in my last two videos like a few things that I've been purchasing. So if you guys want to watch those, I have a haul and a fall essentials video. So check that out. The first thing is this jacket. So I really love this style. I don't know what this is called. I can't figure it out. This is like water resistant, um, like a windbreaker kind of thing, um, like a bomber style. But I love this like quilted pattern on here. I think it's so cute. Sorry, I'm getting like extremely blown out because of the, my pale skin with the black jacket. But um, this was originally like $70. I think it was $69 and then it was on sale. Sorry, it's so bright. Okay, hopefully the lighting's better. I adjusted it. But this was originally, I think, 69 or 60, somewhere around there. It was on sale for 35. And I do really like how it looks on. Um, maybe I'll just try it on to show you guys with my <laughs> Bay Area sweatshirt. But um, I thought it was a good find because I do like this style. And the reason I also like it is because I'll wear it on the trip in the colder weather, but it is something that I'll be able to wear here too during the fall and winter. I know I'll get a lot of use out of it. Just like an easy throw on. And um, I mean, it's not really a look with my bagger shorts and my sweatshirt, but it's like, it's something that'll keep me warm I could layer with. It's not like the heaviest jacket, but I think for the colder weather, I'll wear like a sweatshirt or like some layers underneath. It'll definitely keep me warm enough for like the, you know, West Coast fall that we have. So, um, yeah, it's cute. So that was on sale. Good find. And speaking of layering, I got this bodysuit. It's just a ribbed white long sleeve bodysuit. I think I actually might wear this on the way up. I think I'm going to decide that outfit first, actually, just to get that out of the way, my road trip outfit. Um, I was kind of thinking I could wear this with like a puffer vest. And it's like, Maybe I'll wear it another day too, just like layered underneath something to keep me warm. Okay, next is something I'll definitely be wearing at home a lot. It's something I have kind of in beige already from a different store, but I wear it so much. So when I saw this, I thought it'd be perfect because um, it's like a gray version of what I already have. It honestly looks like a robe. It's just a really cozy, really long line um, cardigan. It has pockets in the front. I mean, again, like with this outfit, I mean, it looks like a robe. Can you guys see me in the mirror? <laughs> this looks like this is like what I look like in the morning honestly when I'm taking LA out to go to the bathroom this is like what I usually wear stuff that doesn't match and they don't make sense but I look comfortable um so this like I said I haven't like a beige color not the same one but it's very similar and I wear it so much so when I saw the darker gray I thought that was just a good investment piece for me because of how much I wear my other one I know that I'll get a lot of use out of this one so this one was about 70 which Kind of seemed like a lot for a cardigan at Zara, but I really like the way it feels and the way I'm gonna wear it, I think I'll get my money's worth. Um, but I also am thinking for the trip, it's like a good like around the cabin kind of sweater. So I can like throw it on in the morning when I wake up cause it's like cozy like a robe. Why am I out of breath? I feel like I constantly need things like that on vacation just to kind of make you feel a bit more homey. Um, so I'm glad that I picked that up. Um, and the last thing from Zara that I wanted to share, another cozy piece to wear around the house these really nice pants they are like almost like a soft like thin blanket material like i don't know how you 
really describe these. They're like a cozy pant, not a sweat, kind of in between of like a bell bottom sweat legging kind of thing. Like, does that even make sense? I don't think so, but they're really nice. They would be really cute if they had like a matching top to wear like a little cozy like loungewear set. These will be great around the cabins. Okay, one thing that I'm definitely bringing, not from Zara, but I just wanna share real quick. I mean, <laughs> It's like the same style, um, but this is a Lake Tahoe crew neck that I got last time I was there last summer And it's just like this really soft Stretchy material and we bought it in the summer and we wore it like in the afternoon like on the boat when it got like colder um, And just like around the cabin, but I think it's gonna be better now since it's actually gonna be cold this time So it'll be really cozy to have um, just a little, you know souvenir that we got last time we were there um, Brie got a matching one. So that'll be cute. I know she's gonna bring hers um, but yeah, so now Now what do I need to do? I think I'm gonna start kind of trying to style some outfits. Okay. I have my road trip outfit figured out I'm gonna wear this new puffer vest from Boohoo. They don't have this exact color anymore, at least as far as I know, they have it in like a beige. Um, so I will link it below. I also decided that I'm gonna wear my Doc Martens on the way up, which might sound crazy for how long of a drive it is, like if they're not very comfortable, but they're pretty easy to take off, so I don't really mind that. I'll just take them off like while we're in the car. Um, but if I could wear these on the way up and not have any bulky shoes in my suitcase, I think that'd be a game changer for me. I'm gonna need the extra room, so um, I don't mind, but I'm gonna wear a cute little outfit. I'll probably post a picture on Instagram if I get a cute one. Um, but up here I have my laptop I was looking at. Uh, let me turn this down. I was just looking at my Tahoe Pinterest board that I created. I will link it below. It's currently private, but I will make it public after this video so you guys can check it out. Um, just kind of outfit inspiration, photo inspiration, um, there's not that many, I kinda need to add more to it, but um, just a lot of really cute pictures, like just some really cute vibes, you know? Like, look at that. Obsessed, that's gonna be me. I really love doing this kind of stuff before I leave for a trip. It kinda just gets you excited. Um, you get some inspo and some ideas. I just love it. So I'll link this below in case you guys are going on a fall road trip to the mountains. Just kinda looking at all this, getting some ideas getting those creative juices flowing, you know? Um, but I think I'm gonna make a cup of coffee right now and then get to trying on some more looks. Okay, this is where I'm currently at. Oh my gosh, this looks like a mess on camera. Um, so, kind of just been styling outfits. Uh, <laughs> looks like more of a mess than styled outfits, but I have like cozy looks and then some like warmer, maybe dinner outfits, some daytime outfits. I've just kind of Put a few things together and then I have all my jeans that I know I'm gonna bring that I'll definitely get use out of. Um, a few little sweatshirts. I need to bring, I think, a few more cozy things. So I usually just like pull everything out, style outfits, and then give it one last double check before I pack it up to just make sure I'm bringing things and like using the space efficiently that I have, you know? I have some shoes over here. I'm trying to decide, I'm gonna bring just one of these sneakers wearing my docks and bringing my old ugly Uggs to where I run the house. So I'm gonna look through this and see what else I need. Okay, I'm gonna make sense of all this madness here. I'm gonna pack them in my packing cubes. I guess I only have two packing cubes left, this larger one. Oh gosh, where do I start here? Um, should I adjust the angle? <laughs> Why do I keep asking you guys questions like you're gonna answer? It's weird. Okay, I'm gonna start with jeans. And of course I do the rolling technique saves room. All right, yay, one thing down. <laughs> okay. I low key feel like I don't need this pair. It's like my least favorite pair of jeans too, so let's not do that. I'm gonna put sweats. Oh no, okay, cool, now we're full. Good. Good, that's great, okay. Is anyone ever like not stressed about packing? Like do you guys just like know what you're gonna bring and it's all good, everything fits, your suitcase zips up. I don't know if you're my kind of girl if your suitcase zips up easy on top Maybe this other hat like why do i have so many hats don't ask that is one packing cube down well i have two down my pajamas are done um so i'm gonna move this out of the way keep this an organized workstation okay now what to put in this little guy 
right? Like what goes in here? Really nothing little left. Oh, my life is so hard. I'm just kidding. Okay, so I'm gonna do this, 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 and then whatever else I can swing. This is wishful thinking at its finest, you know? Okay. <laughs> Also, I know you guys can't see my face, but I've been watching Stranger Things today. I know I'm so late. This is my first time watching it. I just started season two today. Um, a lot of you guys recommended it. When I put a show suggestion on my Instagram, I got a little suggestion box. Oh gosh, this is even smaller than I thought. All right. Um, when I put that on my Instagram, a lot of you guys said Stranger Things, like for, you know, the fall Halloween season. And I've been, I've just, I don't know, I just never watched it. And... I know everyone has seen it. It's like one of those things that I am not in on the conversation on. Like, it's just lame. Like, I need to watch it. So I decided to start it, and I'm obsessed. It's so good. I've been watching it all day. And um, I obviously have been watching season one, and I just love it so much. Like, these kids, like, have me in tears. They're so cute. It's just such a good show. So I'm mad that I've never watched it, but glad I get to enjoy it now. So <laughs> I'm really loving that. I'm the only person in the world who hasn't watched Squid Game, though, so, you know. I'm over here watching Stranger Things, like, it's 2017, and Squid Game is out, and I haven't seen it, so maybe I'll watch that in four years. <laughs> you know? So, okay. That is pushing it right there. So, good grief. A lot of this stuff is not going to be able to go in packing cubes. I'm sure I'm going to go against all the rules by... However, I plan to do this right now because I'm just gonna try to squeeze shit in. That's kind of my tactic today. Should I put my shoes first? Should I go over here? Oh my gosh, that doesn't seem like a good idea. It's gonna have to do, y'all. Okay. Just I wonder what is the best way to do that. Okay, whatever I'm doing here feels so wrong, but whatever. Okay, I'm just putting my jackets down flat. Like, seems like that is a good idea. <laughs> you know what's funny is like, I don't know how, like after I get all this stuff in here, where my packing cubes are gonna go. Uh, I don't know if I should have put those first, but it doesn't seem like it, right? I feel like it's actually very personal to see the way someone's suitcase is packed. Like, this is so vulnerable, you guys. Okay. I am probably gonna have to bring a, um, a duffel bag, honestly. Like, some stuff, like my cosmetic bag. I'm looking at, like, another jacket over there like how the hell am I gonna fit this okay you know what I feel like this should go this way yes that makes more sense to me okay I'm putting one packing cube down small one would fit right there I just want to make sure I can fit the cubes because I feel like these matter the most Okay, and then here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna squeeze some stuff over here. <laughs> uh, I mean, like, I'm going for a while, you know? This squeezes here. Oh, perfect, there's more room. Amazing. Okay. Okay, we're looking pretty good, you guys. I mean, I don't know about all that, but it's better than I thought. Let's do this. Perfect. Okay, fabulous. Okay, one more thing right here. Okay, this is a bit thicker. Gosh. He's really pushing it, you know? Can you just see my head? Sorry. Can you even see it? Oh my gosh, sorry you guys. Pajamas. You can squeeze right there. Fab. Oh my gosh, you guys, I think I'm doing it. Granted, I still have to pack my cosmetic bag, and that's probably just gonna have to like sit on top of everything in the car because it's not gonna fit in there. Times like this, I could really use one of those um, vacuum sealers, you know, 
pack all this stuff up and then suck all the air out. <laughs> that would be crazy, but it would work. Okay, it's looking pretty damn good. It's gonna be tight, but it's gonna fit. All right, girls and boys, let's find out. Oh goodness. Oh no, that's not gonna zip. Okay, 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 that's fine, it's fine. I'm just gonna do it as much as I can. Oh, okay. It's pretty good. All right. Ooh. This is what's not gonna zip. All right, who needs it, you know? Who needs it to zip? Not me. Okay. Let's buckle this side. Uh, okay, that this buckle. Oh gosh, that's not even doing it. All right. Just had to, you know. <laughs> just had to, you know, you know. Okay. This one. We uh, got it. Good grief. Okay. Oh gosh, you guys, this is where it gets hard. <laughs> oh, that's rich. Okay, let's see here. Like this. <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness. Is this thing? Oh, here. I can do this thing to stretch it out a little bit. Is it already? Yes. Oh my gosh. Okay. You know the zipper that can kind of make it a bit. Oh, hell yeah. Okay. Oh, perfect. Okay. Here we go. Do I look crazy? <laughs> okay, let's sit on it. Oh my gosh. All right, what did I tell you guys? We're zipping up. We did it. She's ready. Oh my God, she's heavy as hell. Okay, it's a bit later now. I ate dinner and did like some other things around the house that I needed to get done before we left. And now I'm gonna pack my cosmetic bag. I can't figure out if I wanna wait till the morning to do my makeup. I don't really plan to wear a lot of makeup tomorrow. So you know what, I'll, uh, I'll probably do it tonight. I actually don't know if I'm gonna wear any makeup tomorrow. So it looks a bit blue in here because of the lights on my TV. I'm not sure if you guys noticed that. Still watching Stranger Things. My toiletry bag is from Henry Bendel. I got my initials on there because <laughs> my sister had this makeup bag, my oldest sister, and I just always wanted to be my sister. So I got the same exact one and then I went the extra mile getting my initials on here. But I really like it because it's just like a deep makeup bag. There's no like compartments or anything. It did come with this too. So I'll be putting makeup brushes and things like that in this one. Um, and then like my larger products will be just at the bottom of that, like dry shampoo. Um, what else is there? Hairspray, sorry, I couldn't think for a minute. And um, you know, like skincare and stuff. Just little silicone bottles from Amazon. I have my shampoo and conditioner and body wash in there already stocked up. So um, that's done, check on the shampoo and conditioner. And then this isn't going in my cosmetic bag, but I wanted to share, I'm bringing a few books. I do plan to read a decent amount on this trip, like by the lake while the boys are fishing, I plan to be reading. So um, I'm bringing a book that I'm currently reading called The Wedding Day. It's cheesy and like cute. It's it's okay, it's not my favorite, but I wanna finish it. I'm almost done, so I should finish that quickly. And then I have this one as my next read. I really love Renee Carlino. One of my favorite books ever is by her, Before We Were Strangers. If you guys haven't read that, check it out, but I'm excited to read that one too. Um, so yeah, my glasses. And then over here, I have all my vitamins in my little travel packs, which is amazing. It's my favorite thing. I mean, they're always in these little packs, but it just is really convenient for travel. So I just got, the correct amount of days for the trip. And then over here I have jewelry that I'm bringing. Get lost in this nonsense 
again and again She hangs on way too tight Like it's her dear life And I should probably run away Said fuck my friend's advice Just come through tonight I'll ruin my life With you, with you, baby But Casey, I don't wanna buy you drugs all right, I'm all packed. Got everything I need for tonight. I have some stuff to pack in the morning um, that I'm gonna need to use in the morning. So I'm gonna wait on packing all that. Um, but I also am bringing my duffel bag. This is from Bayes, just like my luggage, which is really nice. Um, I have Ellie sleeping right here. Maybe let's end the night with this. Just a little, a little good night from Miss Ellie girl. Okay, I disturbed her sleep. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, I will see you guys in the morning. Okay, good morning. This is my road trip outfit. I'm wearing sweats with my docks, little long sleeve, and my new puffer jacket, or puffer vest, sorry. I think it looks really cute. And my hair up in a bun, my sunglasses, really like make the look, you know, because I don't have any makeup on. Um, just some brows, which like obviously. We're gonna end this video here and then start the vlog now. So make sure you guys subscribe. I would love to have you guys here so you don't miss the actual Tahoe vlog so you can see our trip. Of course, don't forget to enter the giveaway. It's super easy. And that is pretty much it. I will see you guys in the vlog. Bye.